down to what the lady said about other options that were made available. There was a minority report from the Chatham County Board of Commissioners that was signed off of it, and I read the report. This, this option that was supported by Mr. Galen, Copeland, and Mr. Bob, and Mr. Wilson, is something I believe a lot of folks could get behind. We never said we were against zoning. We're against blanket zoning. And the thing that I keep hearing, I can't, I can't argue all the technicalities of this. I've tried and I've got myself in hot water more than once. But mainly a lot of us in this part of the county, we feel like we've not been properly represented because the majority of people that have had control over this process from back side of the county, the planning board, some of the commissioners, some of y'all, y'all, from back this neck of the woods. This should not be a North Chatham, South Chatham issue. This should not be a political issue between the GOP and the Democrats. This should be a countywide issue to unite this county with options that work for everybody. I really feel that our one would be appropriate in some of the areas around the most dense population, filtering out to us, then change over to a different zoning format. One of the things that was an irritation to me is a statement that, well, it would be too much work for the planning board to do this the first time. You are standing in a school that literally this community had a lot to do with building. My daddy helped plant trees out front when this school opened up. Paul Dixon stood right in here in the classroom and said something important to me. He said, son, he said, why is there always enough time to do stuff three, four, and five times, but never enough time to do it right the first time? If we felt like we had been able to participate in this process and we could get a zoning plan that reflected a lot of our desires and what we would like to see in this part of the county and feel like we are heard, you would not be getting this kind of resistance. I'm not going to argue the technicalities. I'm, my argument is this. A lot of us are angry because we feel like we're disenfranchised. Our votes don't matter. The intellectual stuff. Our votes don't matter because we're overwhelmed by what everybody in the northern corner of the county wants. Well, why can't we have both? Why can't we address their needs and work out from that area with zones that take care of the issues there? But when you get back on this side of the county, there's not a lot going on. Let's be less intrusive to people's property rights. I'd like to see this county united again instead of split down the middle. And this has probably been the most divisive thing I've seen in my adult life in this county to go on. And it needs to stop. We could all work this out, but not with a one-size-fits-all or one plan. And, and that's what I came to say. Thank you all so much for your time.